time to do a shade video. I know it's been a while, uh, but I just want to refresh my YouTube uh, channel and let you know that I'm still around. And I'm, of course, without a doubt, still doing a straight razor shave on an every other day basis, so to speak. Uh, today I'm using this uh, lovely high class Kibitz uh, 5 Ace Full Hollow, uh, just freshly. Uh, took it off a codical stone this morning, which is what we're going to talk about a little bit. So let's get started here. It's a lovely razor and a lovely edge. Football season for my grandson started yesterday. He's quarterback, such a good little ball player, it's my favorite time of the year. Summer's coming down to an end. You can start sensing that fall is approaching. So, The opportunity to see my grandson play football on Saturdays for the next eight weeks. And when that's done, Kentucky basketball starts up. For over the past month, I have been battling an upper respiratory infection combination of sinuses draining and uh, allergies unlike I've ever experienced in uh, really taking its toll And currently I'm on a codical kick. Everyone knows I love my Nakayama Asagi. Uh, I've got a true black arc that I also like, uh, but I don't use as often. Uh, I, I love the feel of the edge. It's very comfortable and close shave. Uh, kind of sense though that it doesn't hold an edge as long, which is kind of irrelevant when you've got stones right at your fingertips. You know, you can refresh a razor in no time at all once you got a good bevel set on it uh, to maintain a keen edge. Uh, so one or two shades and you can take about 10 minutes and refresh it and boom, you're right at it again with a brand new fresh home shaved edge. It's been well over a year that I purchased a codical from Superior Shades. Jared down in Jacksonville, Florida. I could get a good edge off of it, but I was one of those who fell into the cock wedge, just doesn't quite do it for me. So it hadn't been getting the love that my others have and then just recently I'm like man I've got to break that thing out and um, I watched some videos on YouTube regarding codicles and uh, man it got me fired up to, to to accomplish an edge that I would be very happy with and uh, what I had learned one night laying in bed the light came on I couldn't wait to wake up the following morning uh, to see if what I was thinking was going to work for me because they say each codicle is different and you'll see a number of people saying you know I don't really care for codicle edges uh, they're not sharp enough they don't provide me the a close enough shave as uh, I really like and uh, I 
I'm kind of guilty of falling into that category. But I figured it out. Let me lather up and do my second and last pass. I'm doing a two pass shave. Tell you what, you get what you pay for. This, uh, man. This St. James. It's, it's some awesome shaving soap, shaving cream. So, um, getting back to the red light, or the light coming on in my head laying in bed. I'm like, let me... This is against the grain, by the way. Let me apply more pressure on the stone with my razor and see if that'll work. And bam, that was a ticket for me. That was the ticket and I have been getting some crazy edges using my conical. Those that are not familiar with the honing, and you'll hear people talk about different edges. You know, what's the difference between different edges? Uh, mainly a conical is a natural stone. Arkansas stones, they're natural. Uh, Japanese natural stones, they're natural stones. And uh, they just provide a much comfortable shave over a synthetic stone, which are your man-made stones. And a lot of people finish with a 12K Noena or Nanawa or a 20K Sahara or a lot of those are shaft and glass stones. Uh, And when you use a uh, synthetic stone and finish on it, I mean, it's a surgically sharp stone. Surgically sharp edge. And uh, it will do the job on your face, no doubt. It'll take care of your beard. But they're less forgiving. We're natural stones. It's like they know a difference between your beard and your skin. I'm not saying you can't nick yourself with a natural stone. But if you nick yourself real good, it's definitely user error. Probably your weepers are imperfection of the skin and grown hair coming in awkwardly or whatnot. But what I really like most of all about a codical, now that I've figured it out, so I'm done, man. I've got my black art figured out. I've been having my Nakayama Sagi figured out. And now I've got my Kotical figured out. And I got a 20K Sahara kind of sitting there. Uh, and I, I used it the other day for a razor that um, somebody had sent in. Uh, but what you really got to appreciate more than anything off codical stone is yes they do provide close shaves they provide comfortable shaves but my goodness 
the post shave is like super BBS and it lasts, it seems a, forever. I mean, you shave at five in the morning and at nine o'clock at night, you go to bed with a BBS. And I am not kidding. You can wake up the next morning. And And it's still close. I mean, you don't have to shave it every day using a cortical edge. Which I don't anyways. I love shaving with a little growth on my face with a straight razor. Wrap this thing up. We'll do the whole shave. Whoo wee! Smooth, I'm telling you. Okay, it's Sunday. I'm getting ready to go to church, but I waited to apply my aftershave gel um, prior to going to church. Um, but this is where you really appreciate a conical. I mean, that is super close. This stuff is really cool. Sprints on there. Man, <laughs> I'm hooked on codicles. I'm telling you right now, I am. What, what a shave. And that will be that close all the way till I go to bed tonight. Another thing I've gotten into here recently is uh, another rabbit trail. I don't know how long I'm going to be on it. Uh, some of the niche colognes that I've purchased are rather expensive. But uh, there's nothing more that feels good, you know, when uh, when you receive compliments. Everybody receives compliments. And uh, when you wear nice men fragrance, uh, you pick up compliments all the time. You know, whether it's from females, your wife, co-workers, uh, even men. Wow, what are you wearing? You smell really good. Uh, I like to get a bottle of that, you know, and, and that's what you experience. And uh, I've been on YouTube and uh, I'm picking up on fragrances in the fragrance world and uh, I'm really taking a liking to it. Uh, I've got this for the fall season approaching. I love Bay Rum. This is a boozy, spicy um, men's cologne and it's rather reasonably priced uh, in comparison to some of the other ones that I've recently purchased. But this stuff is, is powerful. So just one, one boom, you know, that's it. That's all you need. This stuff lasts 12 to 14 hours. Again, that's Bentley Intense, made by the car makers. And uh, it's a great fragrance. Uh, so hope y'all enjoyed that shave. Uh, kind of brought you up to speed. Uh, for those who have been sending me uh, your razors for honing, thank you so much. Uh, not because I'm trying to make money, uh, because I don't charge that much, but uh, I just enjoy honing them. When I receive uh, a razor from y'all, uh, to be able to put an edge on it, get it back to you, and then receive the compliments uh, of the shave that you achieved with it, thank you so much. Uh, I love honing your razors. So, without further ado, thank y'all so much for watching. I'm back. I'm not going away. And as always, shave on.